last adult one. Um, wait, because then I have a character but one too. Um, so for the adults, we have a, a, the one picture there is the Hogwarts clock tower, which we actually built last week. And you'll see it in the videos with Dr. Crampuche that we, um, we haven't shown it. We, we got to show some of those at some point, um, Traven, but, uh, we'll put them up on YouTube. We put one of those together that Hogwarts, um, the clock tower, and it's a, what they are, they're Rebbit 3D puzzles. They are so much fun. Oh my gosh. If somebody in your house loves to do a puzzle, you will love the rabbit puzzles. And if they are a puzzle maker who loves Harry Potter, it's like, stop, get out. It's, it's like crazy making so much fun. Last year we put together Ollivander's wand shop, of course, uh, at Christmas time. My family absolutely loves it. It, you know what? It is puzzle making, but then there's an extra element to it because then you put the 3d together. It is ridiculously fun you guys this right here that i'm holding up is the bus the night bus they have almost everything that harry potter ever ever was the award winner though was that clock tower it is so beautiful you'll see it in the video that we did with dr grand Pichet. but i wanted you to see they they have everything it is so much fun and they're not the hardest puzzles it but you will when you sit down if you're a puzzle doer and you sit down to do it and you go wait a minute this isn't your typical puzzle thing where you just look for the edge pieces. You really got flexible of thinking. Oh my gosh. Um, but then once you get it, it's like getting over into a different part of your brain. So, so good. So, so, so good. I love that Amanda says, uh, my son will love that marble run, but he's, uh, five. Uh, and check the age range on it. And if your child is not somebody who's putting things in his mouth, it might still be appropriate. I, we say this all the time that uh, there are, there are things in the adult category that might be great for your six-year-old. And there's things in the six-year-old category that might be good for your adult. We put them in the age categories to start, but you know, check out all parts of the toy guide. Thanks for watching Autism Live. If you found anything helpful in this video, please give us a like. In fact, make sure that you smash that subscribe button on YouTube and give us a like on Facebook. You can also follow us on Twitter and Instagram for important updates. And please download our free podcast wherever you get your podcasts. See you next time. Until then, give your kiddos a hug from me and one for you too. Bye-bye for now. To subscribe, click here. And if you'd like to check out some more of our videos, click here.